Well, hi there, Pluckers. I have a sore finger again with you. Thanks very much for joining me for uh, another guitar lesson. This is a classic song from uh, Paul McCartney and Wings called Bluebird. Okay, um, I'm going to do it. Uh, the lesson is going to be in standard tuning, no capos, as you can see. Um, if you want to play along with the original recording, you'll have to detune your guitar uh, to D standard tuning. Uh, using exactly the same chords that I'm going to show you, but uh, you'll have to detune the guitar a whole a whole note. All, every string on the guitar has to go down a whole note, okay? Just so you know that, okay? But uh, for, for convenience sake, I'm in standard tuning, okay? So here we go. I'm going to do um, a couple of verses, a couple of choruses, and the iconic um, rundown bridge section. And I'll break that down for you. Uh, and then uh, I'll do a little bit right for the, there's a little bit different right at the end of the song which you need to know about, okay? So um, we'll do that as well, okay? So without more ado, uh, let's get to it. Uh, it goes straight into the verse, there's, there is no intro, okay? So here we go. <clears throat> Late at night when the wind is still. So let's break that down for you and then we'll uh, move along, okay? So, um, the first chord is A minor 7th, okay? So, bar on the 5th fret and 7th uh, fret on the 5th string of 3rd finger, okay? And uh, it goes straight in, there is no intro, and it's all downstrokes to start with, and it builds up, okay, underneath the singing. So it starts off sort of light and builds up, so... And when it, and it goes down two frets to G minor seventh, and that's where the strumming starts, okay? And the up and downers, okay? So start that again for you. <coughs> to C G minor seventh to C to F major 7th, which is, right, so it's F with an open first string, okay, so just to recap, A minor 7th to start with, building up, down strokes, and then to G minor 7th, two frets down, bar on the 3rd fret, 5th fret, 5th string with the 3rd finger, and that's when this up and down strumming starts, okay, to C, Back to G minor seven. Da, 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 C. I'm a bluebird. I'm a bluebird. F major seventh to G minor seven. And the best, the best way I can think of playing this, which isn't too difficult for most people, is just to bar the first four strings on the third fret with your first finger, and just concentrate on strumming those four strings. Don't try and hit all six. Just, just, just the first four strings, okay? So just to recap, just do the first course, uh, first, first again. Exactly the same as the first. Da 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 da
7 to C, F major 7 to G minor 7. So that's the verses taken care of, and they're all the same. Now we come to the iconic bridge section, right? So it's uh, blue, 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 this bit, okay? So we start off with a D minor, but I wanted to play it slightly different. Normally you'd play it like that, okay? Uh, what I want you to do is replace your third finger with little pinky. So your first finger on the first fret of the first string, the second finger on the second fret of the third string, and Pinky is now playing the third fret of the second string, okay? So you've got this third finger free, okay? And we'll need that in a second, okay? So what you do is basically you arpeggiate the D minor, just pick individual strings, four down to one, okay? Okay? Then place your third spare finger, you're keeping the D minor held, um, put your spare third finger on the third fret of the fifth string. Hit that note on its own. Then, whilst holding the D minor still, the second, uh, sorry, the third string and the second string. So, fifth string with the third finger pressing on the third fret of the fifth string. Sec uh, second on the third and third on the second. So, it's fifth string, third string, second string. Okay, so. Then move your third finger down to the third fret of the fourth string and just play that note on its own. Okay, so so far then. Then form an A seventh, standard A seventh. So that's A seventh with an open third string. Okay, okay that one. And what you do is you arpeggiate the A7, the individually hit strings. You just go from 4 down to 1 again. After, so, so far we've got this. Okay, and finally, keeping the A7 fretted, start from the 5th string and go to the 2nd string. Okay, then repeat the whole thing. D minor. Got that? So coming out of the, um, we'll, just do, we'll just do the second verse and then go into that, shall we? Okay, so. Uh, Touch your lips with the magic. You know what love can do. I'm a bluebird, I'm a bluebird, bluebird, yeah, yeah. I'm a bluebird, bluebird, right? This is the D minor bit. Blue, 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 blue. Go to a B flat major seven. Blue bird, blue bird. To an F major seventh. Now the B flat major seventh is um, basically um, a bar. If you can do a bar, that's it. That's better. First fret, and then you put your third finger on the third fret of the fourth string. Second finger on the second fret of the third string, and pinky is going on the third fret of the second string. So you've got basically that triangular shape but with a bar on the first fret. And basically you just need to sort of strum down and then go to the F major 7. Okay, then it goes into another verse. Okay, so we'll do, um, we'll do a complete verse completely with the arpeggiated uh, D minor bit, okay? So, second verse onwards, okay? So here we go. <clears throat> Touch your lips with a magic kiss And you'll be a bluebird too And you'll know what love can do I'm a bluebird, I'm a bluebird, bluebird, yeah, 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 yeah I'm a bluebird 
Here comes the deep one a bit. Blue, 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 blue. 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 Okay. And that's it. It just repeats everything then. Okay. The only difference is right at the, the very last verse of the song, um, where it comes, so I can't remember what the words are. I haven't got the last verse here, but same as usual. Apart from that, <laughs> okay. So the very last verse. It does exactly the same chord wise as usual until you get to the bit where it goes, I'm a bluebird. Okay, so. I'm a bluebird, I'm a bluebird, I'm a bluebird. Da, 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 da. So that's two lots of D minor. Or oh, three lots of D minor, actually. And then a single strum. On the G minor seventh, okay, for first four strings on the third fret. Got that? So, uh, excuse me, will I just scrap my cat? Uh, Oi, get down. That's it, she's off. She's climbed up the door. <laughs> right, okay, so. Uh, bluebird, I'm a bluebird, I'm a bluebird. And then it goes. Okay, double picks here. So you've got the fourth, uh, you've got the fifth string on the fifth fret, along with the sixth fret of the second string, down to the third on the fifth, with the fifth on the second. So, and then first on the fifth, with the third on the second, open fifth, second on the second. Okay, so that's fifth on the fifth with six on the second, third on the fifth with fifth on the second, first on the fifth with third fret on the second, and finally open fifth with second on the second. So, so. And I'm hitting the fifth string with my pick. And then picking the, pulling up the, uh, the second string with my finger, so it's a double pick really. And then it does the uh, that bit again. Okay, so so it goes. And that's the end of the song. Okay? So we'll just do the final verse to end the song. Okay, so whatever the words are, I can't remember. and uh, listening thanks very much and uh, sorry about the destruction of the cat there at the end <laughs> she likes to get her little appearance in from time to time and i'll see you in the next video bye for now